Before we get started today, I'd like to take a moment to say thanks to Lamppost Island for this lovely bit of artwork of he who goes by the unforgettable name of the dog they call the Sniffmaster G. Thank you very much, Lamppost Island. And speaking of islands... We got the dog, dog taste. We've got the dog, a new dog, island cereal. A yumma yumma. Hey there, fellow dog islanders. This is Un, with more of I Played a Thing, the dog island. And last time we, uh, had a little bit of navigational mishap, but in the end we reached our level cap with Sensei Road and learned that in order to become a sniff master we must perform good deeds. That's part of being a sniff master, just as much as shoving our nose into everything. Oh, you guys again with the tomatoes. I thought we were past that stage. Ah yes, Pupper Snoopers the G is so very intimidating. Anyway, as I was saying before I inadvertently triggered an event, uh, we also have to become a Sniff Master because that is the only way to find the legendary flower, which is the only thing that can cure our poor sister. <clears throat> Yeah, we kind of already know your story, Francis. Ah, uh, one brave fruit won't last you forever, huh? Of course. We'll get gratitude. And that feeds the Ankh tree as well as progressing us in our cause of becoming a Sniff Master. An incident. We don't like to talk about incidents. I don't like where this is going. Uh, what happened to your friend after that, Francis? Oh my god! Did you kill your friend? Well, maybe not, but that's... Oh, God! Wow, the Dog Island. You're you're not afraid to go there, are you?
<laughs> okay, Francis has to defuse her sins. Because she killed her soul. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, I think that's a worthy cause. And to avoid any uh, unnecessarily running around. One wolf is certainly worth the travel. Or the travel is certainly worth a wolf, I should say. You're a gentleman, Boris. Anyway. Oop. I kind of wish the Victory Gangsters wouldn't do that. It's really kind of unsettling. That's a very odd precondition for trust, but we'll, we'll work with it. Hey, it sounds like we got a new mechanic. Close to it. Press X. Okay. Chase it around. X to jump. Watch the timing bar, etc., etc. Yoink! That's not so bad. Is necessary. -ry? Okay. A little problem with your lips there, Clark? Oh, for being an untrustful gang member, I have to say you're rather helpful. First, see if we. Oh, well, that was easy. G -g 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 ghost Well, uh, Francis, I would say there aren't too many hard feelings here. I killed you!
Aww. <laughs> In any other situation, that would seem like quite the non-sequitur. Well, that was really kind of sweet. I'm glad that, uh... Dr. Potan and his nurse don't both have completely tragic backstories. Wow, we're just triggering events all over the place. Stop that! Yes, we've heard that before. I don't think the Victory Gang understands what trust is. Okay, so we need a cabbage butterfly and a black bass. I wonder if we caught a black bass before, but I'm not inclined to sift through the other videos right now and find out. indication of where the cabbage butterfly is to be caught. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't know where they are, do you? This is the nearest open area, so I guess we'll take a look here. Oh, that's right. We got rid of the bees after quite the adventure, so I guess we can check out that desert area now. Maybe that's where we need to be. The fact that our left scent thing is not going up makes me think that probably the, the butterfly is not in this area, assuming that's what I'm supposed to be smelling. Sure like that lotus. Ah, and so we are introduced to status effects. if staying hydrated is actually a mechanic of some sort, or if that's just flavor text from Patasi. I'm sure we'll find out. Oh, hey, there's a meter under my life meter. Seems like there's a scent over here, but I can't actually reach it because of all these rocks in the way. Oh, nope, there it is. Tasty. It seems that that meter is gradually getting more full 
of red. So, should probably keep an eyeball on that. Don't need more bananas right now. Gigilly Village. That's probably significant. Let's see if we can drank up at the oasis here. Oh, and our red goes away. Cool. Anything important about the Sphinx over here? There's a mystery aroma. Sweet potato. Okay. I gotta say, for a uh, you know, cute game about super deformed dogs, there is a surprising amount of depth in the dog island. Quite a few mechanics and mini games and such. Nice to see that. Uh, UKs put uh, some effort into this. Well, let's check out that pyramid, and if there's nothing of interest there, then we'll uh, take a look at the village. But as always, we'll want to investigate any mystery smells that our increasingly well-trained nose picks up. Sword. What is that? Is that a hedgehog? Giggly Village. Let's give it a look. Hmm, nice place. Watch out for snakes! We got a fast traveler here. That's handy. Well, it doesn't seem to be anyone else out in the open here. We'll just check out the various establishments. <laughs> we could have redneck pupper snoopers. Nice. I'm thinking nothing suits us quite like the uh, tulip hat right now. Okay, I gotta admit those are pretty sharp. Expensive though, and I I still don't think anything quite suits him like the uh, the what you call it the uh, what's the word I'm looking for sunglasses. Let's grab a standard issue backpack. It's uh, fairly cheap. Oh, that should do nicely. Now, can we equip the backpack along with our bandana? Let's find out.
That doesn't look that way. Well, let's stick with the bandana for now. Here? Nope. Nothing in the stables. How about you, Izzy? Got anything for me? Hmm, really cold ice cream. Suppose it's a good idea to have one of those on hand just in case. Must be really cold ice cream if we can carry it around indefinitely. Thank you, Mr. Sutherland. Not in here. Okay, that's the inn. Don't really need to look at that, I imagine. Good advice. As well, keep exploring. Holy smoke! Visibility not so good. There is an oasis, so that's fortunate. And a mystery odor. We always want to investigate those. Oops. Where is it? There we go. Passion fruit for a passionate pupper snoopers. Let's see if we can ninja this cover here. It's quite alert though, we gotta be Oh, okay. Yep, that'll take some careful timing, I think. but the game seemed to think it was an important item. Oh well. If we need it, we'll have it. Oh crap. was kind of unsettling. There's really nothing too pleasant about seeing a small puppy get sucked up by a quicksand hole. But at least it just means we get spit out by a pyramid like it's a mini golf course. So I'll have to be more careful about where I walk. And why are there hedgehogs in the desert? I don't think that happens, does it? More mysteries. Mango! Tasty. Follow the coastline for a little while. See if there's any desert fishing that can be done. Mind the cobra. Nothing like that here. Where's my oasis? Quite a ways to the west. Let's hustle in. Whoops! 
Careful with that dash button, Eugene. God, that's really uncomfortable to watch. Really gotta watch my footing here. The oasis is roughly northwest. So we're gonna take it a little slower and not get sucked into the bowels of the earth again if I have anything to say about it. This is what we need. Let's see if we can reach the dry valley without any further mishap. There's another sink. Oh, come on! I didn't think I even got that close to it. One more try, and this time if I can't get uh, past that last sinkhole to the dry valley, we will punt and look elsewhere for our butterflies and whatnot. Let's try approaching from something more of a right direction. Oh, wait a minute. I think that covers... Yeah, looking at it now, that's a pretty broad sinkhole, and I think it covers the whole entrance to the valley. Yeah, that's not something we can mess with right now. Alright, fair enough. So, back to the village. I wonder what actually happens if you overheat, like if it's an instant kill or what. I hope not. I think we followed this coastline. Probably no desert fishing here either, but always good to check. Good to be thorough. testing the metal of these uh, new poisonous snakes and found them wanting. Hey, can we catch a bee? No, it doesn't look that way. Not sure if I ever checked out that beach to the east here. I'll give it a look. And there is a fishing dock here. Might as well see if there's any black bass to be had. If there's one thing Pupper Snoopers the G is all about, it's earning trust. Got 
some pretty easy catches here. One more try. Well, either I'm not getting the right random number generations, or it's not here. I remember you. Alright, back to town, and then I guess we can check the areas between Zumi and uh, Pupsville. Where am I going? Okay, it's west. Understood. So, no plot progression in the desert areas, but we did uncover quite a few new aromas, and that's always a positive. Gotta figure out where that bass is. If I don't find it in my experimental fishing today, I suppose I can always uh, review the evidence and get that figured out before the next video. But for the time being, you're just going to have to bear with me because, as always, for the Dog Island, we're doing it live. Hey, that's what we were looking for. Right outside of town. And now you have to believe in me. Wasn't that hard, Curtis? So Amalia and Alex are fighting, and Alex never seems to leave his book tent. So that seems like a good place to go. We'll just take the Boris Express. I wonder if that's Gili Village. Gobble, gobble. Let's see what the problem is over here. Oh, poor Alex. Overeducated and underqualified. I feel your pain. I gotta say, I'm, I'm sympathetic to both of them here. You know, you do have to pull your weight, uh, you know, if it's within your ability, but... And, and you do have to get out of the house a little, but it's important to have dreams. 
I am the variety. <laughs> oh, are they siblings? Yeah, you know, I... I really don't think anyone's completely in the right here. Amalia and Alex both have their valid points. Okay, that much I can agree with. I have to try and be a little more well-rounded there, Al. Well, you don't have to make it out like that. <laughs> Alex is a sharp... <laughs> Alex is sharp. Ready. Wait, do you want me to bring you the sun? I think that might be a little bit difficult there, friend. head turns forward and a burning head that wears a white dress. Yeah, I'm not real sure about that one. It's probably really obvious, but what can I say? Riddles have never really been my thing. Oh well. We should stop by the restaurant and check in our fruits. Where's the restaurant at? I think this might be it over here. Hi, Andrea. Yeah, that's it. it. That's a new fruit. My pleasure. I think we had some new flowers, too. I believe this is the right house. Mm -hmm. 
New registrations, extra woofs. A good outing all around. Pigs. Nothing on our important scent meter here. Still no idea where exactly I meant to find that butterfly. Bridge is still broken, so we can't explore in that direction. Well, I guess we can still check the Treely Woods. Sheep. aromas hereabouts. Hmm. Life is full of mysteries. Anywhere else we can explore from here? Hmm. Oh, hey. I wonder if that... No. No, that's where we came from. Sorry, I had a stupid navigational moment there, wondering if there was a different exit to the Green Meadows, but no, that's the one we came from. Nothing exciting about these shrooms. Oh, hey. Oh, there's a pumpkin, might as well collect it. But more importantly, there is a mystery, an important mystery here. Special grape. I have no idea what that is for. Well, I'm sure we're bound to need it eventually. Hey, bug. Okay, so we can't really smell insects. I guess that's understandable. Oop, missed. That is definitely a little trickier than fishing. Whoops! I don't even know what I was thinking hitting the button there. Well, damn it, we are going to catch a bug. Yoink! Trojanus Butterfly. Not what I needed, but hey, always good to expand the collection. I'm just gonna have to keep my eyes peeled for insects, I suppose. They're not sniffable. But I wonder if catching one counts as a smell for our leveling up purposes. No telling, I suppose. I'm just going to get myself uh, onward and eventually back to town, I think. See if we... Oh! New bug! Oh, that one was easy. Oh, 
Also, I couldn't see it at all until the catch prompt appeared. Bug hunting will not be an easy bit of business. Except this one's nice and visible. Hey, beautiful! to go now. Oh, that's right. Zoomy Village. Not a problem. Well, that was quite a fortunate find. We're gonna get the hang of this yet, viewers. Clark, give me your trust. gang badge and an opportunity to play matchmaker. Sounds like fun. So we'll take the Boris Express once again. We'll see what's going on with the Prince of Pupsville and then I think we'll call it a day. mansion we might as well turn in our fish and bugs Nice to meet you, Derek. I know how collectors work. Snoopers the G, Doctor of Love, has arrived to solve all your problems. Oh, Pete's got it bad. No problem, I'm here to help. going to drug her? Oh, no, no, no. He's going to drug himself, I think. I hope. Give him romantic courage.
<laughs> I think Pepper Snoopers is getting a little tired of all these fetch quests. Yeah, I really hope this is something Peter is going to use on himself. Otherwise, this feels faintly unethical. Oh well, gotta advance that plot. And since we know exactly where to look for it, I think we have enough time to take care of this little quest here. There we go. Piece of pudding. Let's not get stuck on the geometry there, Pupper Snoopers. I could really get used to this Boris Express, but I'll have to keep an eye on my woofs, make sure I don't overspend myself too severely. Alright, Peter, here you go. You better not be doing anything creepy with this. Okay. Okay, just a Courage Enhancer. We feel better about this. Yes, we do. What? just kind of out of nowhere. And I think we've accomplished enough for one day, so we'll do a mail check and then we'll turn it on in. And for next time I will see if I can figure out what the story might be with Alex's riddle. That oh, looks like no mail. Yep, no mail. Yeah, I'll try and figure out the answer to Alex's riddle and what I need to bring him. And then we'll also investigate the cloud remover. I will look forward to it, and I look forward to your company once again. Until then, this is Zun. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you again soon.